Hey everybody, welcome to Combat Saturday for September 26, 2020. I'm your host, DM Galabond. All right, today on Combat Saturday, we are going to be looking at a weapon that is relatively new to D&D. It was first introduced in 4th edition uh, called the Maul. M-A-U-L Maul, like a wild cat or a bear mauls its prey. Um, so... That is the weapon we are looking at, and let's first of all uh, see what 5th edition says about the Maul. Uh, it's a 10-pound weapon that costs 10 gold, and is heavy and uses two hands, and it deals 2d6 bludgeoning damage. Okay. But exactly what is it? For that, we actually kind of have to step out of D&D and go and find pictures of what a mall is. And a mall is just a fancy name for something that you might have seen laying around your house. That's right. It's a sledgehammer. A, um, and... It's a large, long, two-handed sledgehammer. So the um, variety that we uh, probably would be most familiar with these days would be the big, long, 10-pound uh, sledgehammer that has like usually about a six-foot handle or something on it that you might use to break up uh, concrete or, you know, something like if you're... If you're taking up your driveway and repaving it, you might use um, something like a big 10-pound sledgehammer to like break up the concrete of the existing driveway and then pull up the chunks. Um, that's sort of where it would where it comes into use. It's kind of a demolition tool um, in the modern sense, and it was a demolition tool on the battlefield. Uh, there. There's some historic debate about how uh, how these weapons would really be used. A maul would probably be something like a peasant weapon um, as opposed to a weapon of war. Uh, a large hammer that would normally be used like for driving uh, fence posts into the ground. And then if they got attacked by somebody, you could just take that big hammer and whack them with it. Because if you're in heavy armor, uh, a maul is going to dent that armor and um, could very easily break some bones of people inside armor uh, because it's so heavy and it strikes with so much force. But as we said, in 5th edition, uh, 10 gold piece cost and weighs 10 pounds. Um, and its first appearance was in 4E. Uh, where it again had 2d6 damage, uh, cost 30 gold, weighed 12 pounds, and is considered part of the hammer group. Uh, now, this 12 pound weight, that's probably uh, closer to the actual um, weight of a modern uh, two-handed sledgehammer, because that uh, this 10 pound thing, that's just talking about a 10 pound head. Then you have to have the weight of the whole handle. This, this, a thing like this, is probably closer to like 15 pounds because of how solid that uh, handle is. But D and D terms, um, it's 15 pound or yeah, 12 pounds in uh, fourth edition and 10 pounds in fifth edition. All right, very simple, very short today. Just uh, telling you what the mall is all about. All right, if you like what we're doing here on the channel, please subscribe, like the video, share the video, uh, click on the post notification bell so that you 
uh, are notified every time a new piece of content drops. In the description, you can find all of my social media platforms as well as how to follow the live streams that I do every week. And with that, I uh, just hope that everybody has a wonderful week. Good night, everyone.